Well, hey guys, welcome back. Thank you for joining me today for yet another Dollar Tree haul. I'm so excited to share with you all these new amazing goodies I found at Dollar Tree. So let's get started. So my store had two sizes of the candy cane wreath frame this year, which I am tickled to see. So this is the one from last year, um, or the one they've had almost every year actually. And this is about, I think this is about 21 inches long. And I've used this many times, but this is the first time I've seen the smaller one, which I think is adorable. And the smaller one is 14 inches in length. So they're just super cute. <laughs> um, hopefully you can see the, the difference here in size. But I like them both. They can both serve a different purpose, but I think this new small one is just adorable. It's so little and cute. <laughs> and check out the ornaments my friends i'm telling you dollar tree has the best assortment of ornaments this year i'm so excited i found um, these ornament balls in three different variations and this one is they're they're like a styrofoam ball and this one is just the white with a red and green studded decoration on it if that's what you call it um, they're just like little red and green gems and each of these have a satin ribbon hanger on them and they're uh, these come in a pack of six then i found these as well um, this one's the sequined and then this is also a white like a white styrofoam ball with just the red bling on it but all these come in um, with six pieces they all have the satin ribbon hanger this one has the red satin with ribbon hanger they're cute you could make these really easily um but uh not for any cheaper i don't think than what dollar tree is offering them in these six pack bags um this isn't reversible this is just sequins when I was little, a friend of ours, a friend of our families would make ornaments with us and we would make similar ornaments to this. They were really fancy though. We used all kinds of little, I don't know what you call them, like just little pieces of decoration. A lot of the sequin type, these type of decorations, but we used to make these all the time, little ornaments, and they were so pretty. Then I found this uh, black and red buffalo check garland and there's six feet of garland here and it's on a twine string it's really tied up <laughs> so that's I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get this untangled okay there we go so they're pretty they're spaced really far apart but they've got the loops on the end so it's just a regular garland six feet but there are only five um, five balls on here so not a lot but you could always add to it there's a lot you could do with this and once again I found the elf feet the ornaments and I found them in two different styles at our store I always find a use for these it seems so these are the green feet and this one has the red feet just a couple different designs let me know if you've seen other designs of these these are the only two that my store had I found these pine cone ornaments. I think they had these last year, but I don't remember for sure. And there's six on each of these. These are kind of a bronzy color, I guess, gold bronzy color. These are my favorite. They're so beautiful. And here's the gold. And then these are kind of a beigey silver-ish. I can't think of the name right now. <laughs> there's a name for this color. and. Uh, for the life of me, I cannot think of the name of it, but y'all know what I'm talking about. But these are really cute. I find lots of uses for these. These just have twist tie hangers, but you could put um, any kind of hanger on there that you'd like. I don't usually use the hangers. I don't use them to hang. I just use them in projects, but really, really beautiful. All right, y'all, how cute are these snowman ornaments? I have never seen these at Dollar Tree before. My Dollar Tree's never had them anyway. And there are, again, six pieces on here. Each of these is on a, uh, like a string hanger, a white string hanger. Look how cute these are. I found two versions of this. One with the red Santa hat and one with the um, 
typical snowman hat. These say uh, warm wishes, warmest wishes. And these say merry and bright. These are something, these look like something we find at Walmart in their um, tiny treasures or whatever they call them with the all the miniatures. Um, that's what this, these remind me of, what Dollar Tree's coming out with. But um, of course this one has the black and red buffalo check and this one has the black and white buffalo check. But these are adorable. And again, six on each. So cute. Obviously, Dollar Tree's really getting on board with the buffalo check this year. <laughs> and um, so these snowflakes come again in um, six each. And this one has the backdrop of kind of a black and white buffalo check pattern. And this one has the red and black buffalo check pattern. And they're just little piece, uh, snowflakes made out of wood. But these are cute. I think these are kind of some of my favorites. I can think about multiple uses for these. They're super, super cute. And these do come on that white string as well. These are another amazing find. All right, guys, check these out. I think these are just gorgeous. They're just small pieces of wood, uh, real kind of thin, but I mean, they're really, really nice little uh, red trucks with the tree in the back. Four pieces on each of these. And again, the same uh, white string hanger as most of the rest of their ornaments this year. These are gonna make great fillers and projects. These are going to be great for hanging on the tree. I probably will use these on some of my smaller trees this year. I think they're just gorgeous. I was only able to get two. That's all my store had, but I'm happy to have um, two sets of these. And once again, I found the little uh, red trucks with the trees on them this year. I think these are pretty much the same as they've had in the last couple of years. There's four on here. And these have the little wire hanger on them. And I've had, I'm pretty sure these are almost identical, the same exact ones. Um, I don't have some to compare because I used all of mine last year, but um, I'm, I'm almost certain these are identical to what they've had in the last couple of years. But these are always a hot ticket item. So if you see them and you think you might need them, get them because they won't last long. Right. These I think are some of my favorites also next to the snowflakes and those trucks. <laughs> They're all my favorites, who am I kidding? There's four on each, but how cute are these? Naughty or nice, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays and Holly and Jolly. These are definitely something you'd find at Walmart. I hope y'all can find all of these cute little Christmas items this year. And I super love these little plastic um, clear snowflakes. They're so elegant looking and they look like glass. They are plastic, but these come with six pieces and they have that same twist tie hanger. Again, you could change that out if you wanted to. Um, I won't use the hangers on these. I will definitely use these in a project. I noticed they had these same white uh, rustic looking bells this year. So I grabbed a couple of these because these are great for projects. And I use these on my tree every year also because they're just so pretty. They're kind of rustic looking. We've got our little sprig of pine needles, a bow and a pine, couple pine cones. And these are just always a big hit. Our store had um, the red glitter and the gold glitter ones also, but I usually don't pick those up. I like these, just the plain white. So grabbed a couple of those. I did grab a few more wall stickers from my store that I thought were super cute that will be really neat in some projects. And this one says, uh, since little fingers touch our floors, please remove your shoes at the door. Cute. This one says, our family's gathering place. Sit long, talk much, laugh often. Just cute little sayings for some projects. And this one says, let go and let God, with a pretty little floral design. And this one I've never seen before. This is a world map wall sticker. I mean, it's pretty cool, really. So on this side, you have Canada, the United States, and Russia. And then if you flip it over, you have Brazil, you have Antarctica, Australia. I mean, this is pretty cool. Pretty cool. These are the only placemat designs I've seen um, for the Christmas holiday so far at my Dollar Tree. Um, and these are the fabric placemats. They are 12 by 18 inches. 
but I'm holding out. I'm hoping that they come out with some new designs. I don't remember if this is from last year. This is all my store had, so it might have been from last year, but it's pretty nonetheless, and I'm, I'm just waiting, hoping for more. I really like the tapestry um, style placemats, so I'm hoping they'll get some of those in for the Christmas holiday as well. So my Dollar Tree once again has the um, the metal word decor in the piece, Joy and Believe. This looks to me like it's exactly the same as it's always been with each year. So um, I don't think they're any smaller or larger. They look exactly the same to me. So I don't know if they'll be coming out with um, another design or if this is it for the year. I'm thinking this is probably it, but we have Peace, Believe, and Joy, and they're just little metal pieces. I often will paint these and use them in projects, but um, they're really pretty, just as is also. My store actually had more of these uh, floral garden garden dishes, which usually I only see in the springtime, so I was really excited to see a stack of these at my store, and I picked up a few of these because I use these when I make my faux scales. If you guys want to see a video on that, uh, let me know in the comment section, and um, I will show you how I, how I make this um, faux scale using these floral dishes from Dollar Tree. Then I found these really cute uh, wood hanging decor pieces in the crafters or the crafting section again. And I mean, I've never seen these before. They are rectangular shape in the crafter square or crafting section at Dollar Tree. And I'm gonna measure these out for you guys. So these are almost 12 inches by about three inches. They're quite narrow, but um, and they're they're thin, but they're wood pieces, and um, I can think of a lot of different little craft ideas to make with these. They've got your twine hanger on there, just cute little pieces. That's the first time I've seen I've never seen these before, so I was pretty excited. Another thing I've been collecting to put into my gift baskets this year are these two packs of fragrance sachets from Dollar Tree. I usually get the lavender; that's my favorite, but I will get probably one. Uh, one pack of each scent to put in my gift baskets. These make great little fillers and um, I love, I enjoy getting a nice little um, sachet. So I always collect a few of those to put in the gift baskets. I finally found the jar. I've been looking for this. I am so excited. I want to do a few projects. I picked up uh, three of these, I think. My store finally had them. I was so excited. And these are just, just uh, metal pieces and they're actually fairly heavy and they come with the twine uh, string or hanger on them and then I found this truck I've seen um, this truck but I hadn't been able to find any of these and I love that they're it's kind of the embossed one they have some that are just flat but I wanted this one so I I found two of these again that same twine string on there but oh I have some cute ideas for this I can't wait to share it with you guys then I found these super cute um, wall decorations these are stickers this one says blessed I found one that says welcome, and then I found one that says faith. I mean, these are really cute. They're kind of um, that bubble, I don't know what you call it. They're raised, and they're just really neat. I like the colors on these. This one's my favorite. It's got just kind of those muted colors, the farmhouse colors, and you could paint these. I mean, gosh, you could do just about anything with these, but I grabbed one of each. That's all my store had, and I grabbed one of each of them. and. Um, another really cool find. Then I found these super cute home signs um, with the the little leafy wreath as the O. And you could take this off if you want. You could decorate this up to make it um, seasonal. Lots of things you could do with these. I found two at my store. That was it. And they're really, really pretty. Very farmhouse-ish. And I think they're gorgeous. I'm just going to use them in our home year round. Love. I bought candy at Dollar Tree, <laughs> so these are really good. Have you all tried these? The Werther's Original, the Creamy Caramel Filled, and the uh, Caramel Apple Filled. This is my favorite. If you haven't tried these, try them. They're caramel on the outside, and they're 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 a semi-hard candy. They're kind of hard when you when you start um, when you first put them in your mouth, and then the inside is ooey gooey. And these are caramel inside, and this one has the caramel apple. Uh, filling in it. They kind of taste a little bit like the um, Jolly Rancher apple. So if you don't like that flavor, you're probably not going to like these. Um, okay. <laughs> well, let's just use the scissors here, Bren. I want to show you what they look like. Uh, 
And these, my friends, will be out on my uh, fall coffee bar. If y'all wanna see pictures of that or some video of my fall coffee bar, let me know down in the comments section. Then I found these super cute tassel plaques, they're called. Just a little plaque on a tassel. And I mean, come on, how cute are these? I love them. This one says, hello world, pink writing. And these are a good solid piece of MDF. You know, fairly heavy. Got the beads on there. My store had several different colors and of course the little tassel on the bottom. And then this one says, dream big little one. I think I'm gonna use these in projects so they may not stay this way or I might use them in gift baskets because they're just so darn cute. But those were a really cool find too. I found one more, y'all, <laughs> that I didn't see. And this one says, uh, be your own kind of beautiful. How nice are these? These are really neat. I love the tassels. They're so decorative. They're super cute for kids' rooms or I don't know. They're just lots of uses for these. They're really be a cute little gift too. I just thought they were neat. I also grabbed a couple packs of these 20 count mini lights in clear from Dollar Tree. I get these every year because I use them on my little trees and then each year if they go out or if one goes out, I have a spare. And sometimes they go out within a year, sometimes it takes a couple of years, but um, I leave my, my trees lit for a long time. So they hold up pretty well, just, the, just as well as the Walmart brand or any other uh, place that I've, I've gotten them. So always pick up a few of these. I found two of these um, milk bottle vases at Dollar Tree. I mean, these are something you'd get at Hobby Lobby for, for sure. These are just so neat. They're glass, so they're dishwasher safe and microwave safe if you'd need it to be. But I'm gonna use these in a project for sure. They've got a, um, a raised design on the outside and then it says since, nine, since 1810, um, dairy, what does that say? Dairy Milk by Heritage Company um, since 1810. Pretty cool, y'all, pretty cool. They're cute. I found one, just one of these Scarecrow uh, felt craft kits at my store. I just love these. I have a snowman and I have a tree uh, from last year and I think one from the year before, but I've never seen the Scarecrow before, but that's what he can look like with all the pieces. And I just think these are so cute. The kids love these. They're just felt pieces that you can add on to the, um, to the body and they kind of, they stay put, you know, they're, they're not glued on or you could glue them on, but um, they're just a fun little little thing for the kids to do. And um, I have fun with them too, if I'm being honest. <laughs> but I was excited to find the Scarecrow one. I think he's really, really darling. So I grabbed a few new candy jars to put out on my, um, my coffee bar for the fall and my hot cocoa bar for Christmas time and this is just a really super cute kind of an old-fashioned looking uh, like candy glass candy jar you know where it's kind of tilted towards you kind of reminds me of like the little little house on the prairie when the kids would go into the mercantile and grab candy out of the dishes <laughs> that's what that reminds me of but really really cute and then this one is just a um, I don't know I think they've had these every year for as long as I can remember but I needed a few more um, candy jars this year go figure and um, this one fit the bill because I like them to ha have a little bit of uniqueness I like to have a few different jars um, you know shape jars out for interest and these jars are for uh, the candy that is not wrapped I always try to get individually wrapped candy but when I can't I like to have a nicely um, a jar that seals really nicely so the candy doesn't get stale or or whatnot so and these will fit the bill I found so many cute uh, black and white buffalo check items at Dollar Tree this year. Here are some of the placemats. I grabbed two of those. And most of these are gonna be used um, in gift baskets this year. I might be making something out of these. I don't know if I'll make a pillow or something different. You'll have to wait and see. Okay guys, so I started collecting 
um, items from Dollar Tree and other places for gift baskets this year for the holidays. So if you guys want to make some gift baskets with me, just start collecting things here and there that you might want to put in your gift baskets. I grabbed two of these cups from Dollar Tree. They both say blessed. I wanted them to be the same because they will go in the same gift in one gift basket. And these are microwave safe and dishwasher safe. And they are the Greenbrier brand, which is the Dollar Tree brand. I had a hard time finding any that didn't have, you know, some like scratches on it and whatnot. I mean, these were the best that I could find, um, but they're okay. We'll just call it farmhouse. <laughs> then I got two of the blessed plates to go into that basket. Look at these. How cute are these with the black and white buffalo check? These are also dishwasher and microwave safe, and they are ceramic. And this one says happy fall. I love this design. I think that's so cute. This one says, count your blessings. These will make excellent um, gift basket fillers, my friends. And this one says, gather together. So again, if you plan on making gift baskets for the holidays, now is a really good time to start collecting everything that you might want to use to make those. And Dollar Tree had these fleece neck warmers this year, which I mean, these are really nice, you guys. They're so nice. They have the little um, pull on them so you can tighten them. These are really nice. These are 100% polyester, hand wash cold, do not bleach, line dry. And then I also found a uh, just a black fleece scarf. These are again really great um, for for gift baskets and or gift ideas or wrapping gifts with I like that these don't that the scarves don't have the fringe on them this year the ones that I've seen do not have the fringe on the bottom which I kind of like I grabbed a few more of these um, black and white buffalo check collapsible storage containers these are great for making gift baskets so I picked up a few of those and then I grabbed a couple of these, um, the oven mitt in black and the um, two pot holders in black. Just a regular pot holder. And these are probably gonna go in some gift baskets. And then I grabbed the dish drying mat as well in that same family of the black and white check. I like to stay with a theme when I do my gift baskets. And so anytime I see a theme, I grab as much as I can that I might wanna use in that basket and collect that um, actually throughout the year, what I wanna use in gift baskets. Although these pieces are, you know, kind of a black and white check, they're, they're a black and gray or brown. I'm not really sure what that is, maybe a green, <laughs> but um, I'll also use these. These are just plastic pieces, a plastic tray and a plastic plate, and I will use these in some gift baskets as well. I grabbed one of each of those. And that concludes this Dollar Tree haul, my friends. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed bringing it to you. Thank you so much for watching. I'm always grateful for you carving a little time out of your busy day to spend this time with me. I hope you'll give this video a big thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed, I'd love it if you would subscribe to my channel and be part of the Brands Beauty Boutique family here on YouTube. And be sure to click on that bell if you'd like notifications every time I upload a new video. I have a lot more to share with y'all coming soon. Thanks again for watching. Have a beautiful day. Everything will be okay. All I want to do is spend this holiday with you. Tomorrow is.